Get Carter. Carter is a 1971 movie directed by Mike Hodges, starring Michael Caine, Ian Hendry, and Britt Eklund. Oh, fancy that. Hello and welcome back. My name is Dave, and I'm your host for today. Right, got another Michael Caine film here for you. This is a 1971 crime thriller. It's one hour and 52 minutes approximate long, and it's one hell of a roller coaster ride. I tell you, this one is something different compared to the last one I showed you of, uh, I think it was Alfie. Anyway, Jack Carter is a cold-blooded London gangster. And not the sort of man you want to cross. You know, cross mean like, tick off, sort of, piss off and all that, get angry, basically. And, uh, you know, when his brother winds up dead, uh, you know, Mr. Carter, and we're going to call him Mr. Carter. Uh, just give him respect, because otherwise he'll come and shoot you with that gun he's got there. Anyway, Mr. Carter, he has to travel to uh, Newcastle in England, uh, if people don't know that, to arrange a funeral and uh, convince that his brother was, was murdered. You know, of course, you got you got to assume that to start with. You've got to assume your brother's murdered. Um, very boring on the inside of the case, but very white. Um, let's see. Carter questions local thug, Eric, who eventually leads him to a kid, King Ping. No, can you? Uh, anyway, I'm not sure. Where I, can. I can't read really that, but get one saucy lady on the back there. See, there we go. He's not bad. He's a sort of a naughty girl. Should be showing you that. Look away, people. Don't look. Oh no. <laughs> Uh, from there, Carter Gear uh, craves a blood trail of revenge through the uh, seedy underbelly of Newcastle and search for his brother's killer. <laughs> of course, of course, of course. And, of course, he gets it, doesn't he? He gets it. I like this film. It's a very interesting film. And as the, uh, the, the, the search told you to start with, it was a... It's a very good film. Yes. <laughs> It, it gave you a good, it gave you a good thing, didn't it? It told you a little bit about something before you did. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, w, double Academy Award winner Mike Kane has very look cooler as a uh, well dressed heavy, heavy in other words like a um, gangster sort of uh, barman sort of thing, a man stood at the next to the front door of a club, that sort of idea, attempting to uncover the facts behind the death of his brother in this hard boiled thriller. The film takes Kane. As he becomes embroiled in a sinister underworld of crime and pornography, John Osborne stars as the uh, flesh uh, pedal, peddler's uh, ringleader, was uh, 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 some girl um, sizzles as King's London girl. Uh, Get Carter's powerful combination of violence and corruption, with dark portrayal of England, especially Newcastle, uh, signalled the end of the sugar-coated 1960s. Uh, ushering in a more cynical style of filmmaking. Yes, you can definitely tell. It is a, it's a very big film, actually. Um, little warning. If you're 18, you can watch this. If you're not, you're under 18, forget about it. Bugger off. So I think I should have said it at the start, really. Uh, please, um, yeah. It's a very it's a very strong movie, and it's sort of a thing that if you're a light person, like a like-minded person who's easily influenced and uh, quite easily uh, drawn to things and all that it's a very um, it will mess your mind and it will take some people a couple of times to watch it to get an idea how it works how this film revolves and how things uh, are phrased in that but it's very good how it all this works out and it just it's a film that drags you into thinking who's going to get it, what's going to happen next sort of thing and the the picture quality is different to uh, say Alfie, which, you know, compared to Alfie because he's in Muckings and that's one I've seen about six years earlier um, but the picture quality is definitely changed a lot and uh, the way that's directed and the way the act and the way it's written and scripted and all that it just it banks this is a, is a sort of different way and uh, it's very enjoyable actually, it's a very different take on to uh, coming into the 70s um, very strong film very good film and it's one I definitely will recommend for you to watch 
So I will thank you very much for watching this video. Please tickle that like and subscribe button and leave me a comment down below. Otherwise, here come and shoot you. Thank you for watching and goodbye.